a friend of mine woke me up at 3.30 in the morning with a text, he's English, that said, well, for once the Nobel Committee got it right. I, I, I felt what Springsteen describes as, it ain't no sin to be glad you're alive, like the sense of exhilaration and glee. It's been a challenging year for the entire planet and for the nation. And this is like a cloud of goodness that has frankly lifted me and all of us in the field in celebration for the campus, for the field, for the future of CRISPR, which, by the way, is here. <laughs> there, this is Cas9. This is Jennifer's discovery. This is, the, this is the secret sauce, the magic deep down inside that makes it all work. So glee, exhilaration, mm -hmm. and also a, you know, a sense of purpose, right? Jennifer spoke this morning about the fact that CRISPR will have an extraordinary impact on the life sciences and biomedicine and on agriculture. The Innovative Genomics Institute, I wore this t-shirt on purpose, mm -hmm. um, is focused on precisely that. The, the Jennifer founded the institute to make sure that CRISPR gene editing makes a fair, equitable, sustainable, planet-enhancing impact. And that's what we're all working on. So as I said to a colleague of mine at the AGI, Ross Wilson, OK, now we just have to do it. Jennifer uh, comes across as the quintessential scientist. Isaac Newton was once asked, how did he discover the laws of motion? And he said, by thinking on them continuously. Jennifer Doudna, in every interaction, comes across as who she is, a scientist to the highest degree who has spent her entire professional life thinking deeply about the mysteries of the universe. The fact that one of her discoveries, right here, is about and is already changing the planet is a magnificent testament to the power of basic research, to the fact that a great public university such as Berkeley is the way to make these discoveries and then advance them to a, to, um, in, in sort of fiat lux, let there be light. But back to Jennifer personally, she could be so, what's the word I'm looking for? The level to which she's down to earth, sincere, supportive, friendly, is who she is. And while I would imagine many folks who would have made a discovery of such caliber, although there are not have been many folks who have made a discovery of such caliber, could potentially assume a certain regal air to them, Jennifer is one divided by regal. She is one of us. She's a peer, a true peer, and she always makes you feel that way, and that, frankly, lifts us all. Jennifer, thank you from the bottom of my heart and the bottom of the hearts of so many hundreds of thousands of people working on using CRISPR to make for a better planet, for giving us all something good to do for the rest of our scientific lives. <laughs>